What is going on gamers, Evatrix here and today we're gonna go ahead and uh, do the last few runs for Lost Battlefield now. This week we've done pretty solid, 1339 which actually puts us right now at number 9, so pretty solid, top 10. So we need to finish strong to ensure that we at least stay somewhere along there. The team is gonna stay relatively the same, I did make one minor change, it, I went ahead and put Sprint 5 on my Medusa. now. She used to have Psy Shield, and that's usually to um, to make sure that she doesn't get stunned at the beginning, like by a Dread Drake or something like that, but the Sprint can also come in handy, so I'm going to check that out. And also, I just got the new hero, not the new hero, the new pet, um, and I put them on Demogorgon just to test it out for now. We will see. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and hop into it and see just how we do. We just gotta, we gotta do solid. Let's see what do we get. So we get a Zurdo, 1406. So we get a Dread Drake. More than likely, that's his Ares team. So I'm going to use my own Ares team and then the Ronin team. Let's see how that shapes up. Okay, so I was correct about the Ares. And I get my proc first, and that usually means a victory. Now it comes down to the next few teams. Let's see how this goes. There is a Medusa in... Ooh, this team is super heavy. There is a Michael... A Ronin? Wow, that's a strong team, but I don't think... Yeah, that was a strong team, but it was just my front line of Skull Knight and Anubis really, really took it to him. So there we go. We get our first win. Just got to keep going like that. 1383. I think I'm going to take that because I don't really foresee many people being above. So I don't want to start refreshing and going down. So I'm going to take this. Now, Multanica, that's actually not one that you see often. So I'm, I think I'm going to go with my Ronin team and then my Ares team. Let's see how that shakes up. Let's do it. And it looks like... Mm, okay, Multanica didn't get to proc. The thing is, my Ronin might kill himself. Yeah, it's going to come down to my Skull Knight and my Anubis. Now, I think the only thing they have is the Michael. So if that's the case, we should win. Well, there is the little Nick there too, but I don't think little Nick can do that much damage. Not at this point. There we go. Okay, so we take that, and I believe now we have our Ares team. So that's that's usually our go-to team. That is a super heavy team, though. We have to kill the. Okay, we had to kill that Anubis before the Valentina proc because if not, we probably lose that one. All right. So here we go. We're at 14:11, and see, he went down to 13:26. That's what I was afraid of. Mmm, let me refresh and see what it gives me. 1376. I'm telling you, that's probably the best that I can probably find. Now, I see an Atlanticore. Not even evolved. That makes me wonder. Is this like a fake? Uh, I don't know. I think I'm going to use my Medusa team, see how it goes. And then my Ares team. That's a peculiar Atlanticore. Okay, so... Medusa was pretty fast. I don't think it was that fast, though. I might have to put her on Blitz, but I like the ones that I have on Blitz now in Ares and Valentina. So, ee, that's going to be a tough call. But this one was a pretty easy win. Uh, I don't know how they got that many points because their team didn't really look that great. Just being honest. All right. So, we would have to average 30 points in the next few rounds to actually get 1500 I don't think that's gonna happen because we just don't have anybody to beat with that score but we'll see so we have Kzerzus 1394 I highly doubt I'm gonna get much better than that so let's go Ares team first I'm pretty sure oh I thought that this was gonna be an Ares team but I stand corrected and I'm going up against an Anubis this might be a problem a timeout problem really Hmm, how is this gonna work? I think I think I might time out here. And is something keeping my energy down? I can't tell. I know the Anubis is healing up, but I cannot tell if something is keeping my energy down. Is that a corrode Anubis? I I honestly cannot tell. And having Anubis in the back is really weird, but it worked out. It, he won this one. This is going to be rough for the next few. 
I don't know why my Ares missed the uh, the Anubis. So yeah, there's that. My uh, the Anubis was completely missed, which is rough. Kill, kill. There we go. I need I need this to do damage. A lot of damage. Okay, one for one. Now it come down to this team right here. Can we take it home? Ooh, it, it it's looking good. It's looking good, but can we finish it off? Oh, they have that gunslinger. This might be rough. Come on, it's looking okay. It's looking okay. The Skull Knight. Oh, the Skull Knight killed me. That, that Anubis, that first one, I should have won that one. I don't know why the Anubis was not targeted. I'm kind of... I kind of want to go at it again with the same team. Yeah, let's do it again because I really should have won that one. And let's use the Medusa team as my second. Okay, let's try this again. I really should have hit that Anubis the first go around like this. But I just didn't. I don't know why. And I think he's still going to stay alive. Oh my god. This Anubis is a problem. Um... Can we, can we get him to be silenced, maybe? That'll be great. Right here. Oh! Okay, he just died twice, though. I'm pretty sure he just died twice. Can we kill him here at the end? That is gonna be the question. Anubis is so tricky, man. Oh, my God. He is so tricky. Looks like we did get him. Oh! That was clutch. Ares proct. I, I could have sworn he died like three times though. I don't know. Or four times, I should say. Um, ooh. This one was rough. Yeah. Wait. Wait. Oh, <laughs> the Archangel comes through. So I picked the wrong team. So we end with 1477. So close to 1500. I really wouldn't have even gotten it though but with cards i would have easily gotten it if i was to use what just one card right now would get it for me but i just don't have any cards so it is what it is um we'll, we'll go ahead wait for server reset and then go at it again all right we are back so i went ahead and checked out the rankings i am at nine although i'm pretty sure that some probably hit 1500 now i don't know how many so we're probably 11 12 just depending on how many actually hit um, 1500 they'll be in a completely different bracket so still top 15 ish is fairly good in the android server so let's go ahead and do our runs now um, let's refresh it um, 1494 now here's one tip i can go ahead and challenge can't forget but looking at his score his team is probably going to be a loaded team so just for future reference, when you're refreshing on a Sunday or I guess Monday, you don't have to go up against the top target. I believe it only has to be above 1100 depending on where you ended to get the max points. So just keep that in mind. With that being said, I do see that there is a heartbreaker here. So I'm going to go with that one um, just because I can still get the max points regardless. So let's go ahead and do it. We'll go with Ares. Ooh, seems like that was the best choice because there is an Anubis in that team that I have no wishes of going up against. So there we go. Once the Archangel is gone, we'll take it. There we go. Cool deal. And then we'll get to see the Medusa team once again. Let's see what they do Ooh, against, against Ares. See, and this is where I would prefer Psy Shield Medusa, but it's still going to work mainly because the opponent didn't have the heroes to actually take me out on that one. But that's one instance where the size shield would be better. And that kind of makes me want to switch back. I don't know. Um, who do I go up against? We're going up against... We'll go up against D-Bags because I don't like D-Bags. Let's do it. Um, okay. I missed the Ares, but I guess I'm still going to win. I really hate when my Lil Nick and my Dread Drake both miss Ares. Like, that pisses me off. You, like, it shouldn't happen. Oh, this one might be interesting here. He's going to take me out on that one. The Cupid did a ton of damage on that one. Quite interesting. Okay, and then on this one, we're going up against 
an Anubis. That is going to be hurtful. Although we took out we took out the We took out the Golem fairly fast and the Anubis. Wow. That was a little easier than I thought. I thought that one was gonna give us some problems. Alright, who do I wanna go up against here? Um let's go with Hanoi the N, just because. And we'll just keep going with the same teams. Why not? And there we go. Ares versus Ares. You usually should win that matchup unless you get super unlucky with a proc missing or something along those lines. This this uh, this seems very similar to the t type of teams that I just went up against. The only thing is that um, I got to proc first. But that doesn't really guarantee me the victory because I still have to kill this Anubis. And I don't know if I'm going to have the firepower. Actually... He's dying quite quickly, so maybe maybe I will. And I do have the Michael proc, so that is very very good. Yeah, I think I, I think I got it. I think I got it. And this should be his last revive, right? If he has another one, I might be in trouble. He has another one, I might be in trouble. Ooh, the the revive. That's what makes Anubis so broken. He has so many revives. It's ridiculous. And I think I just timed out. Yep. That's really what makes Anubis so broken is that he has so many revives that it's it's not even like it's not even fair. But we should be able to take it this this one though. Yeah, we should be able to take it. I got way too much damage on here. Yeah, there we go. So so far so good. We got two more to go. What the hell kind of name is that? <laughs> what kind of name is that? Um, I, I'm I'm gonna have to challenge this dude because that name is hilarious. We'll leave the Medusa team for last this time. But uh, this name, this name is hilarious. There we go. Okay, so I picked correct. Was able to take out their Ares team. Now it's gonna come down to what team do they have here. And this one should be a clean sweep. Um, they don't really have anything that really would threaten my Ronin from sweeping them. So yeah, there we go. If you don't have anything tank tanky, you're not gonna beat the Ronin team. All right, and what else? Chasing Oakley or Taiga Taiga? I think I'm gonna go with Chasing Oakley. Um, just cause. No real reason in that one. And again, I'm able to match up Ares versus Ares, which is the matchup that I want, and it's looking good so far. What do they have here? The Michael, the Michael is a problem for Ronin because it makes Ronin basically kill himself and. Obviously, that's a problem. But yeah, it looks like it's done. Okay, cool deal. So we're able to start the week correctly. 325. Like I mentioned, when you're starting off the week, you do not have to, you know, face off against the highest guy. You just got to make sure that you go up against somebody that has enough points. Don't put yourself behind on the first day. Um, but yeah, let me know what you guys think. Should I keep Sprint or should I stay with Psy Shield? I'm thinking Psy Shield. But I'll be taking a, a look at the comment section. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. And until later, bye.